What's good, YouTube? This is Team United Gozus with Max van Neversel, and he just finished top four at the WCQ Nationals in Belgium, in Liège. And um, congratulations, Max. You only recently got added to the team, and you already got that nice top cut appearance. And now we want to take a look at your DAC profile. Yep. Great. Um, let's start Salmon with. Great. Yeah, you started uh, off right away. Sort of Salmon Great is a. <laughs> It's your deck of choice today and yesterday and basically um, let's dig right into it with the main deck. I'm gonna go down here so we can see all the cards yep. and let's go. Starting with the hand traps, 3 Ash, 3 Veiler, 3 Phantasmes, obviously. These are my only hand traps, no impermanence, no Ghost Over, nothing else. Felt fine with those. Uh, gazelle, 3 Spinny, 3 Foxy, then one of each, and the one debug to round up the monster counts. Just, yeah, spend so it that's like. one foul, one jag jaguar, yeah, one foul, and one, one, jaguar, falco. one falco. Uh -huh. uh, most people cut like one spinny, but these I like a higher salmon grade count because the only times when you lose is when you have no salmon grades, mm -hmm. and even spinny on its own can still make heat and make plays uh, easily. Then spells, uh, three circle, two mining. Uh, didn't really feel it was like the third mining or the lady debug. And I was like, yeah, I'll just take the debug. But Probably please. also for consistency issues because we were expecting a lot of rogue over here, and yeah. you don't want to run into a lot of counter counter stuff with the mining and the debug on its own. It's like a Stratos. Yeah, yeah. It just I feels correct to have a debug and maybe sit on your back row. <laughs> I expected a lot of rogue, and I played a lot of rogue. I played seven different decks. Okay, and that's a lot. I, I yeah. I'll just I'll uh, do the decks later, but yeah, three calls and yeah, fusion fire and the spell. These cyclones were amazing. Like, MVP and everything. <laughs> okay, uh, not not quite MVP because we're getting to yeah, your personal real MVP. MVP. <laughs> and three strikes. Look at these beauties. I and will, that's your signature card, I heard, right? I will never play a deck without striking it. I would rather play. I'll even play Sekka's Mermail uh, with Strike in it. Just Look at this guy <laughs> being so convinced of this card. I love Strike, I love back row general, but this guy, he loved no, Strike no, since a, way ago. Uh, <laughs> every matchup I was like, against Sky Striker, they Kagari, I Strike, they have nothing. Against <laughs> yes. Aptur, uh, I Strike, they have nothing. Orchest, I Strike, they have nothing. They're all prepared for like impermanence and stuff like that. And like, Strike, monster gone, oh. Yeah, my turn. <laughs> I, re I really like that. And against Pendulum. Like Pendulum Summon, strike. <laughs> Triple strike in that. I, I played against three Pendulum matchups. It was always like, Pendulum Summon, strike. Yeah, my turn. Oh. <laughs> That's awesome. So, yeah. uh, the extra deck. Uh, three links. Three Wolf. Two Heat Leo. The Heater. This is all standards. And this one. Baguska. Baguska. Like the fat top here. <laughs> I love this card. <laughs> I love this card. You want me my uh, single handle? You want me my top uh, eight matchup against the uh, Endymion Magicians? Okay. Because I opened this, and he had the hardest time getting over it. And he he had Pankratops. He had Super Poly, but it didn't matter because Bagushka was on the field, so he couldn't get over it. And then he made Cerberus with uh, his Pankratops and my uh, his my field that he super polyed away uh -huh. and then he goes Cerberus yeah, effect and I veil it, Cerberus oh my god and then he, he and put in all these resources to get rid of the Basquiska and he just and he had no scales he has nothing else he just and I'm like oh yeah and then time was called and like sudden death and like okay my turn attack <laughs> <laughs> wow that's brutal <laughs> that's really brutal <laughs> for the static I, I swear I expected a lot of rogue so Three Pankratops, two Kaijus, removal for everything. I do not side Lancia. Okay. Because I expected no Thunder Dragon and Orcus is manageable enough. Which is just open dweller and with strike it's just also amazing. Uh huh. So I choose and these were amazing as against having against Sky Strike against uh, uh against Sky Strike uh two Draco, uh Subterror. Oh yeah, I've seen a lot of two Draco around this weekend. There's a lot of True Draco in Belgium, anyway. Like, <laughs> the last two nationals I played, the finals was always against True Draco. So that's, that's saying enough. Alright. <laughs> so then, three twin, 
the Super Polys, the Venom Fusion, for, to have it against Pendulum as well, mm -hmm. which also came in clutch, and then the round is off. That's just for the hate for going first, actually. It's the hate for every. Yeah, if you're going first, you can just go against basically any deck. You can just go open one of these and your standard Salaman Great combo, and even in a mirror match, like, good luck getting over it. Exactly, it's just a yeah. swift, a swift uh, pace change where your opponent just doesn't get to set up with spells, and then you just have that one turn advantage and you just win from there. Yep. Yeah. Nice. So that was the deck. Awesome. For the matchups. Uh, first round was already against Burn. That <laughs> 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 was my first opponent. I was like, uh, oh, this is going to be great. I was joking against him that I uh, could smell a Burn opponent from uh, five miles away. <laughs> and uh, he smelled like bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Damn. After that, I played through Draco. After that, I played Subterror. After that, I had finally the first meta deck, Sky Striker, against uh, Anthony, who won. I completely destroyed him. Uh, then, fifth round, I played against Crusadia Mech Knight. With that that main, guy made it to the top eight as well. Yeah, <laughs> with main deck Red Reboot. And I, I was absolutely destroyed by that. Yeah. <laughs> then afterwards, I saw one great matchup, which, yeah, I lost as well. So at that point, I was going 4-2. I was like, yeah, well, this is not going to work out. But then, Pendulum again, which I can easily destroy with Strike. Then, Subterror. Which I also won because yeah, all of the hate I have. And, and my two opponents in the top cut were both Pendulum as well. Alright, yeah, <laughs> so that, that's pretty favorable for your strikes, right? So <laughs> you designed your deck to win that, and that's awesome. I was just like, Magushka, strike. <laughs> Try something, Pendulum players. What you gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> awesome, nice. Well, Thank you for the profile, that was awesome, and uh, congratulations again for the top cut appearance and top four is a really good result. Um, do you have any shout outs or anybody, any last words, let's say? Uh, shout out to Gosis, to all the sponsors. Shout out to uh, uh, Leonard in particular, because otherwise he'll whine about it. Because I <laughs> shout out to him. Uh, and yeah, shout out to everyone who tested with me, like uh, Kang, Ding, uh, Kim, my friend as well, who also made top 16. Mm -hmm. Like, just everyone. And uh, I'm actually glad Anthony won because he deserved it. <laughs> yeah, he, he played really well. Like, I saw the finals, and his opponent seemed to not have quite the clue about what the Skyscraper Mirror match was. His opponent about. actually said that he did not know how to play the Skyscraper Mirror and that he hated it. So, yeah. You could tell by the way he played. <laughs> yep, exactly. <laughs> but, yeah. They got there. Congratulations. <laughs> awesome. Well, these were the 26 shout outs of Max van Iversel <laughs> from his top cut appearance. And yeah, see you guys on the next time and um, see you in the next top cut appearance. Next yep. profile is coming. Right. Thank you very much, Max. Congratulations.